Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope everybody's having a fabulous Friday morning, uh, getting ready for the weekend. And we're going to get started with this reading for my soul family here. And I am doing 15 minute readings, guys, for a limited time. If you're interested, you can click on the word Aquarius underneath the video. Okay, can everybody see the cards? This is what I need to pay attention to because I don't usually. <laughs> All right, guys. All right, so right off the bat, I'm seeing something just ended for some of you, okay? And this was causing a lot of conflict in your life. Um, this person, I, I don't understand because the person, it looks like that this ended, uh, that you ended this with is someone who is um, very supportive normally and giving and loving. So, but I am seeing an end. Um, and there was a lot of conflict with this relationship for some reason. And I feel like it was some sort of commitment for you. And, but you have this wish fulfillment that, you know, you're still wanting. There's something you're still wanting that you, you don't feel fulfilled yet. You didn't get it. Okay. Um, some of you are dealing with this, um, toxic person, uh, whatever they are, you're not realizing that there's some kind of addiction or mental illness here. So you're very angry with this person because you don't understand this person and what, what's going on. But there's a lot going on behind the scenes, guys, that you're not understanding. Okay. So I just want to show you this real quick. All right. This person has problems. Okay. Um, and you know, for whatever reason, um, Get, you know, all this stuff going on in the background with this person and you're not understanding why and it's making you feel extremely angry. Um, yeah. So let's see what else. Okay. So for some of you, um, your wish fulfillment is about to come true. All right, something you've been wanting for a long time, and that is this romance. This person wants to come in and give you their cup. They are going to come in, and here I have the partnership, guys. So this is a soulmate, and this is divinely guided, okay? This is, this is like a beautiful layout right here. Look at this layout, okay? So here, guys, this is your wish. This is what you want, right? Um, this is also divinely guided and here you have this partnership card, which with the cup and the love coming in is a soulmate guys. And the ace of cups is just happiness and joy. Your cup is going to overflow with this happiness and joy. All right. This is a beautiful layout. I'm so excited for those of you that are going to invite this into your life. And of course, you know, you want to try to stay positive so that you can pull this in or you could help pull this in. All right. So manifestation plays a big part in our lives, whether we're conscious of it or not conscious of it. Okay. Um, people that are negative, you always, we all, we all know one, you know, nothing good ever happens to me. I have a black cloud over my head, you know, this sucks. You keep saying this is coming, but it doesn't come. And that's because they're negative. And when you're negative, you can't manifest and you can't pull things in. You just create more negativity. That's how the universe works, okay? If you're if you're negative and you, you think negative thoughts all the time, well, the universe just gives you more negative because they think that's what you want because you keep talking negative stuff, okay? You keep talking shit. <laughs> that's what you get, all right? And this is a fact. This is already proven, okay? Scientifically proven, basically, that this is, you know, and, and we all know that science and God really move against each other, you know, because science tries to prove, like, figure out what is a miracle. You can't figure out what a miracle is. It's given by God. It's a gift. And, you know, you know what I'm saying. So here I'm seeing somebody is, okay, so you got some money. Somebody just got this Ace of Pentacles here, which is prosperity, okay? And you're seeing this money finally, all right? You've been waiting for this money. I don't know who you are, but you're seeing it. It's coming in, okay? This has kept you stuck for a long time, and it finally has arrived. So I imagine you're jumping for joy right now, 
Okay, there is this feminine in the picture. Um, I don't know where this feminine fits in, but, you know, you're feeling stuck about something. And, you know, maybe now you're looking for some new beginning now that this money has come in. Maybe you weren't happy with this feminine and this is your time to fly the coop. I don't know. All right. Here I'm seeing somebody's feeling really good this morning. Uh, very like just like they want to just go running through fields and and take risks and and just, you know, I don't know how to explain it. Just this free feeling of of just, you know, do whatever. Do whatever, wherever life takes me, you know, um, and this person here coming in, this is romantic, guys. They want you to use your intuition on this, all right? You're probably pulling this person in because of the way you're feeling. You're just feeling free and awesome and carefree. That's the word I was looking for or words. And here I'm seeing, you know, a lot of hard work. A lot of you are working hard and this is, you know obviously helping a lot some of you have had to get a second job and that is helping a lot right now all right we have the star guys okay the star if you watch my videos you know that this is how spirit sees you they look at you like you're the star but now i want to talk about something else okay this star card is also connected to the tower moment in a good way so what this is is you you've gone through your tower moments and now you're feeling good about the decisions you're making. You're feeling good about the direction your life is going in and just where life is taking you. So you're doing a 180 with that. And you're starting to see and feel good things coming in. Okay. This was the past. This, you know, dealing with sneaky behaviors and having your heart broken um, because of the people you were bringing into your circle. They were low vibrating people. And they did not have your interests at heart whatsoever, okay? Now we're going into this new cycle, all right? This is unlike a new beginning. This is a whole cycle, a whole slew of good things coming in for your benefit, guys, okay? So this is powerful. This is going to be really good, all right? Um, and people are writing me and telling me they feel that the, the change in the energy just going outside, they can feel uh, something coming in, something big, something good, okay? Something delicious is coming in, all right? And I'm seeing a lot of you, this is all good, guys. I'm seeing a lot of you are balancing things out where your life is concerned, okay? You're leaving the sadness behind. You're moving out. You're moving away from regrets and sadness and all these the old paradigm guys is melting away all right kudos to you and you're balancing things out in your life things are gonna look good they are already are okay and here i'm seeing love and stability okay so this could be someone who has just come in a great new lover for you this is for my males and my females um, and this person and you together are super tight. You're, you're, you're creating a lot of stability between the two of you. Um, this is, is symbolizing, um, you know, other than stability and money, having like everything you need. Um, there's a castle in the background. There's, you know, tons of money you know this is like a king this is a king of pentacles when you're in this situation you have arrived okay so everything is headed into a positive great direction i'm so pleased guys all right you guys are starting to think positive and you're pulling this in okay this is the only way this can happen for you if you're a sad sack and you're thinking negative thoughts you're getting more of the same all right. Now, I am seeing that I'm picking up on a feminine that is making a very difficult decision. This person is um, feeling possessive over something and is having a hard time letting it go. Okay. This person is feeling left out in the cold, this feminine energy. And it has to make this decision to let something go for some reason and make new plans like start over with their life okay 
so I don't know if that's resonating but yeah there's some ending something's coming to an end because of this sneaky um yeah this is this card is what I feel from this card is this is something more than sneaky this is a person who gets off hurting people yeah this is really weird okay and just everyone who comes in contact with this person after like 10 minutes of talking to this person feels some kind of way like just defensive like you want to run away from this person talk about your intuition guys this is energy you're picking up when you feel bad around somebody okay that's your intuition that's what i'm trying to tell you to use okay and there's some kind of communication coming in that is either going to let you know exactly the depth of you know what this person has done um yeah that that's what it's looking like and over here um this might have been someone that you were in love with or someone that you you loved okay and trusted and gave like your your everything to wow i'm sorry about that guys i'm sending you love and light if that's resonating with you all right um here i'm seeing someone's manifesting crazy money and happiness okay and love okay you guys are manifesting all this stuff you're pulling it in guys kudos to you okay this is an amazing read i'm so excited I don't even know where to go first because the cars are so positive today. Here, I'm feeling like you're ignoring someone else. I don't know who this person is. This is like a more mature masculine, I want to say. And you're ignoring this person. And actually, there's a reason that you need to ignore this person and distance yourself. This is going to be uh, good for you to, to go away from this person, okay? I don't know what they're doing or what they're not doing, but they're not good for you guys. So you made the right decision there. All right, guys, that's the reading. I hope you have a fabulous day. Take care.